happening here, a great event to coincide with Autism Awareness Month will help get you outside and moving this spring. And here to tell us all about the 13th annual Imagine Walk is Joanne Quinn, Executive Director for the Autism Project, along with Michelle Castelli. She is a parent of a child involved in the program. Good morning to you both. Good morning. Good morning. Joanne, let's start with you. Okay. We know the Imagine Walk is happening this weekend. Yep. When? Where? Mm -hmm. Who's invited? Give us the details. And the hard questions. It is this Sunday, April 26th. We start uh, at 9 o'clock registration, but we do recommend people get there a little earlier. We tend to fill up the roads all the way back to Main Street. Um, and we have families, professionals. Uh, we have 211 coming. We'll have horses for pony rides. Arts and crafts, again, that's a favorite table of a lot of things. Okay. Um, and Hasbro's going to be there with some of our uh, toy box tools, so it'll be, it'll be a great day. And really something that, you know, the whole community gets involved in. Our, our station is such a proud sponsor of the mm -hmm. event, as always. You, to see these families come together, and that's what's so great about having a walk as opposed to maybe a run or something that the little kids can't quite quite keep up with. Mm -hmm. It must be so nice to, to have this and see the whole families get together. It really is. It's such a family day for our families because sometimes it's hard to get out without the supports, mm -hmm. and we, we feel that it, we try to make it as autism friendly and family friendly as possible sure. with all the activities afterwards. People hang around until one o'clock with uh, the different activities for the siblings, for the kids with autism, yeah. and the kids with autism from the age of three up to 25, 30, 40 now. So uh, we see a lot of people who have been with us for the 13 years uh, or longer before we did the walk and we meet the new families and we just want to bring them into the fold and let them know they're not alone and that we have a lot of information and if we can't do it for you, we'll tell you where to go. And Michelle, how many years have you participated in, in this walk? Uh, my son has been involved with the Autism Project now uh, for three years. So he's, uh, we're still on the smaller side there. He's eight mm -hmm. years old. Um, but yeah, from when he was first diagnosed, we really didn't know where to go um, or, yeah. or know anyone that could relate as well. And when, once we got involved with the Autism Project, I mean, we just took full advantage of their groups and their parent support, sibling support. I mean, I have friends who are teachers who go there for workshops. I mean, the education, the, the, they, they just, they're just always up to date with the best um, information. And if they, for some reason, can't <laughs> give me the information we need, they always have the resources for us. So yeah. it's, it's fantastic. At least point you in the right direction, Absolutely. right? Always. If they can't yeah. do enough. Yeah. And, and not just for, for your son, who you said, who's been receiving help, but your mm -hmm. whole family Absolutely. Has, has and it affects the whole family. Yeah, it affects everyone you know. I mean, mm -hmm. uh, you know, I mean, w and I think that, uh, you know, awareness is high and then the numbers are higher. And uh, everyone is, is affected somehow by autism, whether it's, you know, directly or indirectly. So it's just good to have the knowledge and, and just good to have a place to go. Certainly. Yeah. So this weekend looks great. The yes. weather looks mm -hmm. awesome. And it actually will be a little warm mm -hmm. in the 50s. So after this winter, I think it'll be a great weekend just to get out, uh, be out in the spring air. There's no soccer and all this going on just right. yet. And uh, have a really nice family Family fun day and a really good hot dog again. We've got. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. You got the food. You got the entertainment. You know, free parking like and good snacks. Day. What can you? Do? What more can you ask for? Sold. <laughs> All right. WPRI 12 is, of course, a proud sponsor of this walk. If you want to check out the family fun happening at the Imagine Walk, it is happening this Sunday, as you mentioned, at 10 a.m. over at Goddard Park in Warwick.